Welcome back to Skibbity Tech. Today, we're diving into the latest version of Appleware Executor for iOS version 1.0.11. This version just dropped, and there are some exciting updates, especially in terms of the key system UI fixes. You can simply go to official Appleware iOS Executor website and download the latest version from there. Appleware Executor is a powerful tool for iOS users looking to customize their device and make the most of its capabilities. Whether you're using it for enhanced controls, games, or customizations, this app has become a go-to for iOS enthusiasts. You can use different methods to install the Appleware Executor IPA file in your iOS device. I will use Feather Signer for this video to install Appleware Executor in my iOS device. If you want to know how to install Feather Signer or eSign or Scarlet in your iOS device, simply watch my videos on that topics. I will put eSign, Feather Signer and Scarlet video links in the description. So, let's talk about what's new in version 1.0.11. Here are the patch notes. The developers have implemented key system UI fixes, improving overall usability and responsiveness. These updates make navigating through the Appleware Executor smoother and more intuitive. Once you have Appleware installed, you're ready to go. Open Roblox, start a game, and activate Appleware to load any custom scripts or commands you want to try. With the latest UI fixes, Switching between scripts and making adjustments feels much smoother and quicker. And that's it. You're all set to take your Roblox gameplay to the next level with the latest Appleware Executor on iOS. If this video helped you out, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe for more iOS content, and let me know in the comments if you have any questions. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.